Yo, yo, welcome back to an amazing vlog. I'm with the Skegonator. What's up? Today, we are picking up my freshly powder coated Mafia Bikes Pablo BMX. Yes! Stop chilling. That's the new colourway. That's what we tried to do and failed, isn't it? Yeah, didn't get anywhere. All right, we're going to take all of these parts my frame, my bars, my cranks, my forks. And we are going to build this bad boy. I wanted to do a special shout out to my boy Sam. There you go, there's the logo. Tilling surface treatments. So shout out if you want your BMXs doing, your wheels doing, all that stuff. He's your guys in Longton near Preston. So we're going to show you briefly what we're working with. We've got forks, specially powder coated, ready for reinstallation. Look good. Looking savage. The thing I'm most excited about. If you're a hardcore watcher of the channel and you've been on the channel for a long, long time, you will know I've been running four-piece square bars while I'm going back to park bars. Looks amazing and it's powder coat, so it will actually last a long time. Back to the garage. Before you break it. <laughs> we're gonna head back to the garage and we're gonna start building this thing, but first we've got to put the standard Mafia Bikes Pablo stickers on. If you're interested in getting into BMX, mountain biking, wheelie biking, Jump Bikes, Mafia sell them all. They've got crazy deals, mafiabike.com or just Google Mafia Bikes and you'll find your bike that you're after. Get involved, thanks for the support. Let's go to mine. Alright, your battery still done to it is. There it is. Should I do it again? Oh, it's oh. um, beautiful. So, I'm wheeling my old BMX in. This is the... Show of you. This is the quiet, quiet. This is the old BMX. This is the last time you will ever see the multicolour BMX. We're going pro on this hype. Let me go and grab my other wheel. Fresh out of the box, free coaster hub. Fresh. If you remember, I used my front orange wheel off this build on this bike. So, check it. It's gonna be a little bit of something something like this. Looks crazy, that. Thanks. It's going to be a loud bike. The only bad bit I'll say is I'm going to want orange grips and I don't have any, which is frustrating. But we'll see. So we decided the BMX has been unpainted for too long now. So we decided to prioritise building a clean BMX in today's episode, which means we have postponed the e-box session video by a few days. We're filming that on Monday. So that's going to be the next bikey BMX skate park type video on the channel. Um, basically, the unboxing video is still getting quite a lot of views actually unboxing that video, so we thought we'd just give it a few more days. Excited for this. Oh, I was tempted to build this up, like. Okay, so the frame, we are gonna start right now from the ground up. Let's put the seat and post on first. Seat and seat post. Denim. Is it denim? Kinda. Your camera's getting sharper every week, you know, Skeg's visuals. Oh, mate, they'll start. This is Harry's vlogging camera. Do not put it on me. Nah, I do like the camera you use for our vlogs, bro. <laughs> Let's do this. So, we have got a seat. Right, the next thing I'm putting on is forks. Actually, it looks insane that already, doesn't it? Yeah, looks Jeez. It looks like it's professional, though. Job. We've got the lower bearing and the race. We're going to do that. We're going to do Oh! Looking good. Looking good. Looks, it. Looks insane. Looks insane that, doesn't it, Dixie? Bearings are in. Headset, headset space is in. Not a lot of um, fork there though, is there? You can't know what you want though, innit? Yeah, let's take that one off though. We'll leave it like that till we tighten it up. More plate. I think it needs a black stem to be honest with you, mate. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, so I'm just nipping these up. Like this. And then I'm gonna come back to them. 
to tighten them up properly. Now we're going to do the, fun, the funnest part, we're going to install the wheels and see what this thing starts looking like. Jeez! This is where the magic happens. Quattro is very interested. He is in here. That actually pops like crazy. Yeah, I think the chrome stem works now. Nah. I'm not a big fan, but I don't mind it. Let us know what you think down below. Yeah, mate, it looks crazy. This. The, yeah, that with the tires looks insane. The, the, real, the real, real machine, the Insta real machine. Is it an eight? Are they are they an eight? One thing. And that was never has never ceased to amaze everyone who watches this channel is my bike building skills. On it, mate. You know what you're doing, there's not. You've built enough. Let's do this. Rear wheel installation. Free coaster, freshy, with a new tire. This is a work of art. I'm glad I've ended up doing it the professional angle and powder coating it, I'll be honest. I am actually glad that it's ended up being this way. What do you think? Right. That's going to stay like that for a sec. We've got a lot of loose components. That's okay. Jeez! A whip like. I don't mind the stem. Mm. It definitely should be black, but I don't mind it. Yeah. Excellent. What have we done, John? I've got metal splinters. Are you close? No. Right. There, there, there. Crank on. So, we're going to put that on like that. We're going to put... Oh. We need spaces. Spaces behind it. Note to self, if you smash your bearings on with a hammer, raw, it will be hard to put the axle through them. Come on, mate. Come on. Oh, mate. Right. I've got the Andy and you crank stuck in there, big man. Go on, Quattro, there's your hammer back. Okay, now we need... A top hat washer, a little small cranky bit, your little cranky bit, right, that on there, that on there, and that on. Light work. Light work. Easier, wasn't it? On. No hammer necessary on the side. So now I'm going to... Looking good, the new whip. It looks sick, to be fair. What do you think of the polished sprocket? Or oh, you're not in on it? Needs to go, in my opinion. Oh, I don't know, man. A little bit of that engineer's touch. <laughs> Sorry for me. You having a good time? I don't feel worth. Okay. I mean, I've got these here. Let's just try these. Yeah, they, they're mint them. They were. Putting my fresh bolts in to my cranks. What we're going to do now, we're going to throw the chain on, we're going to tighten everything up, and we'll be back. We are on the final pieces of the puzzle. Pedals going on right now. Can't wait to try this bike. Those of you who've been riding years will know. A couple of things. Number one, doesn't get better than a 4130 chrome Ollie bike. Number two, you will know that a new bike can make you feel more talented. Like confidence goes through the roof yeah. with a new bike. Balanced it out a bit there. We have one thing left to do. Two things. Two things. Not two things left to do. You're right. Second to last thing. Camo hit main grips. These are classic OG grips. The best grips we've ever released. I forgot links to put them on though. 
Here's one I prepared earlier. What scent? Black. Only the best, mate. Woo! Straight on. The bad boys. They go green, green way inside first. The good thing is, we're not riding this today. We're riding it for the next session. So I can just leave them to set. I'm actually gonna leave them to set a bit further in. No, I'm not actually. I'll do it off camera, it won't make sense to people. But basically I'll leave them to set a bit further and then stretch them out. Cause you can do that. Hello, oh, sorry lad. There was three things to go. What was it? How far ends? If you could class them as a separate thing. As you'll know, as I've mentioned a couple of times in this video, this bike is a Mafia Pablo with a custom paint job. Mafia have been cool enough to send us another sticker pack for the beast so we can rep it hard. Where's the stickers going like that? What? Yeah, yeah, like that, yeah. No pressure to get this straight. <laughs> Damn! Looking good. The cream, Pablo. Would you say it's cream? Or like tan? Oh, that's a good cool question. I think it's somewhere in the middle. Yeah, I agree. It's like diplomatic with it. Beige. Beige? Look at that satin sticker. I'm gonna get one for the front. Mafia logo on the front to finish the build off. And then this is a wrap. It's not it's a paint job. <laughs> Jeez! Looks sick. Mafiabike.com, the beast is complete. Make sure you tune back in. Next video is gonna be us ripping the e-box all the way around the skate park. Might even flip it. Probably not. Then, the session after that, is going to be riding the BMXs, but on the fresh, improved machine. Stickers really finish it off, it looks really cool. Sick, innit? Looks good. Cool, we'll see you in the next video. Make sure you check out MafiaBike.com or just Google Mafia Bikes. Go and get involved, they've got loads of crazy deals. They've got jump bikes, mountain bikes, BMX bikes, wheelie bikes. They've got all types of bikes and they've got crazy deals all the time. MafiaBike.com, thanks for the support. We'll see you next week. Peace out.